This coming weekend, Arizona State plays Arizona. USC plays UCLA. Oklahoma against Nebraska, you can have them all. Around here, there is only one rivalry this weekend. The first step for Michigan, shake off last Saturday's loss to Minnesota. Today, Coach Bo Schembechler said it's not that hard because the game was really not as close as it looked. I thought Minnesota out-hustled it. I thought they out-hit us. I thought they outsmarted us. I thought they out-coached us. And I think the, uh, the only thing that I can say that we out, um, we out mistake them. Ohioans figure the Wolverines are no longer invincible, but at the same time, they are wary what Bo Schembechler might do to his team to get them ready for a payback this coming Saturday in Columbus. You'll never see Bo handle a crushing defeat better than he did Saturday, though, keeping the bitter disappointment inside and under total control, and he says he'll definitely do the same this week. I'm not going to dwell on it in terms of uh, this is going to prey on my mind all week, because if it does, look out. You can't do that. And um, I've been around long enough to know that I want to learn from that. I don't want to forget it, but I don't want to dwell on it. I can't dwell on it. i got to kick it away. Now, after the season, I'll kick that can of film all over, but I'm not going to do it now. I figured um, in, uh, in this season that unless there were some um, extenuating circumstances, that it would come down to this game. This one is special because we are involved in it. <laughs> well, let's not forget these are two excellent football teams with a variety of weapons. Jim Burke has more on the keys to the game. After losing its first two games, the scarlet and gray juggernaut has steamrolled nine straight foes. They've got uh, good skill on offense. They're a smart team. Um, they've stayed uh, relatively mistake-free. Typical Ohio State team. Now, tomorrow's game could be decided by the passing game. Who has the better wide receivers? Ohio State's gifted Chris Carter or Michigan, who has had to replace the talented but injured John Colasar with freshman Greg McMurtry. Michigan's Bo Schembechler had this to say on that subject. Well, you lost, we lost a great football player. Uh, losing Colasar would be like uh, they're losing their great receiver. Um, but... Um, I think McMurtry can uh, handle it, and um, he's got uh, big play capabilities, and um, he's uh, maturing rapidly, so um, uh, we'll be all right in that regard. We're confident you'll get beat. We're confident. We're not overconfident. What's the feeling of the guys? They're feeling good, Real ready good. to go? Yeah, we're ready to go.